Hi everyone, this is Carrie with DoubleClick. Today I want to do a quick video on the ultra thick embossing enamel. It's also called UT. Um, this enamel is a lot thicker than the regular clear enamel that you might use. It makes paper almost look like a very, very shiny plastic. It makes the paper hard. And I love it because it's very unique and I hate it because it's very messy. So I want to do a quick tutorial on um, how it is that I use it. This can be purchased at, I've seen it at Michael's and Hobby Lobby, it's about $13 a bottle. You'll need your heat gun. You'll need some kind of um, Versamark or uh, stamp. And then I use a popsicle stick that I've put double-sided tape on to hold my image so that I don't burn my fingers when I'm using my heat gun. So the first thing that you're going to do is you're going to take your image and cover the whole thing in the Versamark. Then you're going to take the UT, cover the image. It's really thick compared to um, the other embossing. And use your heat gun and you'll see it start to melt. And while it's still hot, you want to dunk it right back in. And the more times that you do this, the shinier your image will be. And heat it up again. And dunk it in again. Now, one thing that you do want to remember is that the more times you do this, the harder the paper becomes, so it, it won't be, sometimes it doesn't lay flat, so you may have to bend it to be flat. Because you can see how super shiny this paper is becoming and how it looks watery. And I'm going to do it one more time. And now this last time that I do it would be the time you can start adding other things to it. Like if you want to add glitter, you would do it on your last round while it's still hot. Okay, so while that's still hot, I'm going to just take some of my glitter and sprinkle that on, and that will melt right on the image. I'm going to heat up one more time. Okay, so there you go. Now my little image is, well, it's very hot. Um, it's very sticky on the back because everything's kind of melted through the paper a little bit. But it's also now, when it dries, it will be hard like plastic. And if you can see, let's see if I can zoom in a little bit better on that, how my glitter is now stuck, melted into the image. It won't come off, it won't rub off ever. And here's the difference. That's how shiny it is. I hope you enjoyed this quick tip. Thanks for stopping by.